Well, this feels a little bit like a, like a nice little halftime break <laughs> before our summer heat wave. You know, that makes me think of like soccer, you know, yeah. like grab those orange slices, get the juice boxes, relax. Yeah, let, <laughs> let the body cool down a little bit, give the AC a break and sleep with the windows open tonight because it is going to be extremely comfortable. That low humidity is going to stick with us at least for another day or two. And then we go back to our regularly scheduled summer, uh, but it looks gorgeous out there right now and it feels even better. Temperatures are in the 70s area wide. 78 is where we sit at Metro. That dew point's in the mid 50s, which is very dry air for this time of year. Remember, 65 is what we consider muggy, but don't worry, we'll get there uh, in about uh, 48 hours plus. You can see as of right now, those green shades of 65 and over are well out there to the west. You got to go into central Iowa, western Missouri to pick them up. So that dry air that's over the Great Lakes again, it's just going to be slowly sort of replaced as we head towards the middle of the week. Here's the visible satellite. Uh, this is the high resolution uh, picture that we see during the daylight hours. And you can see how many of those cumulus clouds were out there. We saw quite a bit maybe more so than sunshine at times, but generally this was still a pretty bright day across the area and rain chances are going to be slim here going forward. We've got one good shot during the work week and that's going to be Wednesday night going into Thursday. We're looking at the European model, which at least this run uh, has got some breaks in that line over us as we get into Thursday morning. It is the odd man out. The other models are suggesting that we're going to have quite a bit of uh, at least some downpours with that line of thunderstorms. So we'll keep that in mind. Otherwise, beyond that, it looks like it's going to be Saturday before another chance of rain. And then once we get past the weekend, we start getting back into those 90 degree afternoons where we start crossing our fingers. If you want the rain, that some of those pop ups are going to hit your backyard. 63 tonight, mainly clear skies and still very pleasant. High temperatures tomorrow, just a little bit higher than what we saw today, which, by the way, was 82 for that official high temperature going to 85 tomorrow. Most of the metro zone also in the mid 80s south zone slightly cooler towards Lake Erie there. Luna Pier at 80 Monroe at 82, but generally mid 80s is what we're expecting there. Same goes out in the west zone. One of the warmer spots here 85 in Flint 84 in Ann Arbor and Canton. And once you get north of M59, uh, maybe some 70s out there towards Lexington, possibly towards Port Huron, but generally low to mid 80s is what we're expecting in the north zone. And we will stay in the 80s through Thursday. Humidity does become more noticeable there on Wednesday, but it's Friday where the 90s kick in. And once we're there, guys, could be six days in a row that we have to contend with it. So enjoy your AC free weather while it lasts. <laughs>